can do uh, whatever you want. I often do do whatever I want. It's what most people do. Oh, <laughs> you said do do. I did. I did <laughs> say do do. This is how we're starting. It's fantastic. It's the Redoo-doo. peak of our comedy. Hey, look, we're all male, okay? We have the maturity of 12 year olds. Our maturity peaked at age 12. We still laugh at fart jokes. So Honestly, I. Everyone maturity... laughs at fart jokes, they're funny. My maturity was higher at 12. It's actually gone down in the past <laughs> couple years. So, we're doing a podcast episode. It's been a very long time since we recorded one. So, I figured, why would we start with an original idea? Because we never have before. So, I. Knew I... It was stolen from somewhere. Uh, I have adapted it. I have adapted it. It is okay. It is, it is legally distinct. It's totally original. I changed ten percent. I, I changed oh. less than ten percent. So, <laughs> is it as distinct as Wind Waker? More distinct than that. Oh, so wow. we're gonna play a game that would normally be called Twenty Simple Questions, but I have twenty one, so it's called Twenty One Simple Questions. But oh. we're doing this flavored. So Um, the point of this is to see how well you guys listen to me specifically and how good of friends we are. Oh, this is going to be bad. Now you understand why I said (laughs) that this could crush me as a person. Uh, You're not prepared to be be crushed. So I'm going to (laughs) randomly pick one of these 21 questions to ask each of you. We're going to take turns. I'll start with Will, then go Kevin, then Will, and Kevin, then Will, and Kevin. Nate, Nate. Wait, 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 let me finish the rules first, then you can start talking. If the first person gets it wrong, the second person has a chance to answer it, and then whoever gets the most points will get a prize at the end. I'm not 100% sure what the prize is going to be. Depends how sad I am, but I was thinking the blizzard of your choice the next time we hang out. Nate. Yes. This is about as bad of a choice as the old days when I'd go home, and my mom would ask if I've like, if, oh, have you been with anyone? Have you done anything like this? Do you really want to know the answer to this? Because there's no answer that's going to make this look, nice. Look, look. On the one are... hand, we might fake it and think, I mean, you'll be doubting us. How the fuck did they figure that out? On the other hand, you'll just know the answer you don't like. No, no. See, it's I made sure that these are all things that I have said to you in chat <laughs> for sure and that I have talked to you about. And some of them you should just know. Okay. Okay. If we get what is your favorite restaurant, I'm going to ace that. That's not on Ace there. it. Well, I couldn't get that. What do you mean you couldn't get that? No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. (laughs) Will, we're going to start with a real easy one for you, okay? How's about that? We'll start with a real easy one. What is my favorite Disney movie of all time? Treasure Planet? There you go. See how easy this is? (laughs) No. If it wasn't Treasure Planet, I was like, oh, I'm going to be... Fucked. I had like four options and they were all equally uh, likely. I'm like, you know what? We talked about Treasure Planet recently. Fuck it. That one. I don't know. I, okay, so I'm just going to say we watched this at your house at every sleepover because it was my favorite movie. Nate, I'm going to throw this out there. Do you want to know what I remember from those sleepovers? No. Playing Dragon Ball Z. All right. Kevin. I don't remember the rest. Question oh, number boy. two. Until recently, extremely recently, what League of Legends character did I have the most mastery points on? I want to say Garen or Urgot. You gotta pick one. Garen. You are correct. Oh, thank Bob. And I actually, when I first did that, because I've I've literally said it in the chat while you were both present multiple Mm -hmm. times, and I actually thought Garen was still my most played champion. He is not. It is now, in fact, Urgot. He just passed Garen, like, last week. Will, we're going to go back to you. Okay. What early 2000s non-secular band did I listen to the most? I don't fucking know. Make a guess. I have talked about it with you recently. I don't know. Reliant K? Correct. Really? Yes. Yes. I didn't know they were non-secular. They are, yes, they are non-secular. They're, most of their songs have something to do with God, except for stuff like, you know, the Sadie Hawkins dance in my khaki pants. You would be excused for thinking that that had no deeper meaning. I don't know what that is, but okay. <laughs> awesome. Kevin. Yes. I don't know how I pulled Reliant K out of my ass. I literally had no clue. Which international bird is known to bark? Like a dog. Yeah, what Caleb said. 
They don't get the reference. Anyways. No one gets the reference. I got the reference. When do we ever get the reference? <laughs> Kevin, what is my favorite Transformer? Starscream? Incorrect. Will, <sighs> would you like to steal? Uh... Uh, whatever that dino guy is? I'm gonna need a name. <laughs> I don't fucking know their names. <laughs> Make a guess. Dinobot! Incorrect. The correct answer was Soundwave. He turns into a cassette player. No points for either of you. All right. Okay. Will, what mm. art project did I complete that made my father the most disappointed in me? I have no clue. <laughs> Talked about this multiple times. Uh, look, I, Nate, I haven't really been putting together a tome of the ways you disappoint your parents. Kevin, <laughs> do you know the answer? How the fuck am I supposed to know that? Because I have told you multiple times. I have told the story uh, every time we have a party. Take look, a guess. Was I, even, was I even in the room? Yes. I doubt it. I, I'm pretty sure I was in the kitchen doing some... Fire dance. Boom, that, boom, okay. yeah. Yeah. All right. So no one, no guesses. No guesses. The Muppet. I made a Muppet. Remember? Why would a Muppet? I literally what? told you the story about when my dad saw. It. He said that he had never been more disappointed in me. I have told you both the story multiple times. Oh, I don't remember, but okay. Oh, <laughs> Will. <laughs> it's about to get worse. No, wait. I started with Will. Kevin. Yeah. Oh boy. Who is my favorite Pokemon? Oh, uh, Joe. So, uh, oh, for it. I will take that. I had two oh. options down. I had two options down. I would also oh, like, accept Mewtwo. Oh, okay. I was like, it's not, I was like, centric. No, 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 because he used it as his ace. It would had to. It had to been a for it at that point. All right, this one's almost impossible for Will, but okay. I did literally tell him the answer to this I when we last streamed. What is my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card? I don't know. Dark Magician Girl? Incorrect. <laughs> Kevin. God, it's a trap card. What is my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card? Oh. Uh, Magic Cylinder. Incorrect. The correct answer is Satellar Knight All Sam. Oh, you're right. I, I do remember you saying that. I, did. I don't know what that is. I showed it to you when no. I showed you the deck right before we streamed. I said this is my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card of all time. That was like less than a week ago. That it's was been probably hot. I don't like, remember. No, it was. I think it was actually like <laughs> two days ago or something. It was. I remember. I, I I do I, I do remember that. Yeah, I, be, I, it's I, your I, favorite I card. You try to play it in it. every deck. Yeah, I specifically said it to both of you. Okay. I will be real. Uh, when you guys start talking Yu-Gi-Oh, my eyes kind of glaze. Yeah, over yeah, I know, I know. Room. This that part of the thing was some of the questions are really easy. Some of them are a little bit harder. The only reason that one would have been easy was because I said it to you so recently. But I knew you weren't listening, so I wasn't expecting you to get that one right. Kevin had a small chance of getting that one right. Okay, uh, I asked Will that one first, so we'll go to Kevin. Kevin, what game series? Do I own on the most amount of platforms possible? Oh, you have told me this. I have. Oh, boy. Does Will know this one? I think I know this one. Let's see if Kevin... <laughs> Kevin, do you have a guess? <sighs> Fuck. Brain, do the thing. <laughs> brain. Brain already. Brain. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, I don't remember. I All do right. not remember. Will? Isn't it Tactics? No, but good guess. I, I, That is a good guess. It is the Ace Attorney series. Uh, I even own it on iPod Touch. Uh. All right. Will, in mm. what year did the Cartoon Transformers movie come out? Oh, fuck. I don't know. <laughs> I have said this to you so many times. It's, it's actually... Fuck it. When, 1912. When, <laughs> no. <laughs> When I talk about this movie, I normally start with the blank year Transformers movie. I vote 1912. Incorrect. Kevin, do you have uh, a guess? Oh, uh, uh, 2003. 1986. Uh, I normally yeah. say 
when I'm talking about it, the 1986 Transformers movie is how I Fuck normally... Fuck if I know. Joke. Okay, Kevin, this one's really hard, but I've talked about it many, many times. What high-grossing Hollywood voice actor was both the voice of the lions from The Lion King when they're roaring and Fred Jones from Scooby-Doo? I have no fucking idea. Third highest grossing voice actor of all time. No idea. Also the voice of Megatron. Yeah. It's not not, not helping. Will, do you know? Bitch, it took me years to learn Caleb's name. Why the fuck do you think I'm going to learn some random asshole's name? <laughs> okay, so I talk about him all the time. His name is Frank Welker. He is in the, has some of the highest amount of credits on IMDb. Not the Nate, highest, but he's really high. Nate, I want you to ask me this again at the end of the video so I can show you that I've forgotten it by then. Okay, uh, Will, what is the first movie I remember going to see in theaters? Uh, fuck, I don't know, Toy Story? It's old? Correct! It was Toy Story. <laughs> Bonus point Your if guess. you can tell me what year it came out. I don't, I can't, I don't care. Kevin, you want to see if you can steal the point with the year? Uh, I don't know. Uh, 1999. No, 1995. Good guess, though. All right, Kevin. I better give you an easy one because that one was really easy, even though Will just guessed. <laughs> I absolutely just guessed. Oh, Kevin. No. What was my, what is what do I consider my introduction to anime? Your introduction to. Oh, yeah, what, 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 what did you consider? Uh, yeah, what did I consider my introduction to anime? I can, like, half picture it. <laughs> uh, Samurai Pizza Cats. <laughs> Not even close, but I like that. <laughs> Will, do you know? Fuck no, I don't know, Pokemon! <laughs> no, what I consider my introduction to anime was Patch Labor on VHS. Oh, yeah. Because I got it from the video store. I was close, it had a P in it! You were close, Will. You have talked about Pat Labor a lot, I just... I have, I have. I, if, to me, it's just the name, so it does not really stick. No, I, I know, and that's part of the reason. <laughs> Some of these are unfair, but that's okay, that's, that's okay. Will! Very unfair. What is the name of the main character in Pat Labor? I have told you before. <laughs> Fuck if I know. You might as well be called Boobtron. Uh, no, she has no boobs. Kevin, oh, do you have any idea? Uh, is, it, is, is it Pat? It is not. There is nobody named Pat in Pat Labor. The main character's name is Noah Izumi. And the robot she pilots is called Alphonse. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't know it. I've, 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 I've talked about it a, a quite a bit. All right. Doesn't sound Kevin, familiar to me at all. <laughs> what gigantic, unreadable book did my sister buy me and I have just begun reading? Oh, fuck. I should know this one. You should. <laughs> I've talked to both of you about how ungainly and large it is. You showed me it. That's why I, I don't know it. <laughs> I don't know. T take a guess. There's no guessing. Okay. Will. Is it all of the Lord of the Rings in one book? It is not. What if I said that it was a terrible Ghibli movie as well? Would that help either of you? No, because I don't like Ghibli, so I don't watch their, their, their movies. Does that help you, Kevin? I mean, I can think of a couple Ghibli movies. It is, the, it is considered the worst Ghibli movie by everyone. It's hard to tell because they're all kind of bad. <laughs> We're not going to get into that. That's an unpopular I, I hate, opinion. I hate the story time. I, I, I completely agree. We're They're not going to get into that. We're not going to get into that. We're not going to... You know, I'm just going to forfeit my vote because I don't want to name the wrong one and piss off the entire <laughs> fandom. Fair so enough. It is The forfeit. Wizard of Earthsea. Okay. Oh, fuck. That's right. Yeah. Yes. Uh, it is considered the worst Ghibli movie. Um, it has nothing like the source material. Uh, it, yeah, pissed off the original author something fierce. Yeah, I don't remember who I asked first on that. I believe it was Kevin... Yeah, so we'll ask yes. Will first. Will, what is the rarest piece of gaming technology I own? I don't know. You're one of your Game Boys? I'm going to need a more specific answer. Game Boy Micro? I don't know. Close, but not correct. Kevin, do you have a guess? 
rarest? Yes. I only no, got that, it. You, I got you, it this you year. You literally showed it. You literally showed me all your Game Boy stuff. I did. I'm trying to think. I was. So I'm, I'm, I'm. Yeah, you had to have been like, yeah, this this one's crazy because you had like that giant box. Yep, yeah, I did, and you I just literally got showed it, this it year. to me. I did. You literally yep. showed it to me, mm -hmm. and I can't fucking picture it. <laughs> all I cared about was the magnet, or not the magnet, the uh, the battery. Yes. I got it at the same time as your copy of Emerald, in fact. Yeah, no, because, yeah. Yeah, 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 I, I, no idea. The no Game Boy idea. Light imported from Japan. Ah, that's Game Boy is. Light? Game, Game Boy, Boy Game Light. Light. Not a Game Boy Light, the Game Boy Light. The only original Game Boy that came pre-installed with a backlight. Uh, my brother bought it for me for $200, which is an excellent price. Okay. Uh, Kevin... What famous musician did I only learn about by watching The Simpsons as a child? Hmm. Famous musician. Yes. Simpsons. Mm hmm. Oh, God. No, uh... Um, now, now I'm just trying to think of what musicians were there in Simpsons. <laughs> yeah, back when I was John a kid. Blank. As well. <laughs> but I didn't really watch that much Simpsons. Ah! <laughs> this is another one that I've used in anecdotes, especially when arguing with Jackson many times. Oh, uh, see, unfortunately, when those happen, I tend to just take my headset off and do other things. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not talking about angry ones. Minutes. I'm talking about when we're joking around. Oh. Uh, this this literally has come up every time he mentions <clears throat> King James. <laughs> I just remember the King James parts. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no idea. Will, do you know? <laughs> what if I told you he did the song Rocket Man? Oh, I don't know. I remember we talked about it, but he I don't did. fucking remember his name. Because, like, you were like, oh, yeah, you should have heard these. And then I listened to them, like, yeah, I've never yes. fucking heard this bitch before. Did that help you at all, Kevin? Mm. Very famous song, Oh, Rocket is it Phil Man. Spencer? It is not. Oh, okay. I actually don't know who that is. Oh. I was thinking Phil song. Collins, not Rocket Phil Spencer. Yes, the song is called Rocket Man. He also guest, guest starred on The Muppets multiple times. Duh. Large Elton John? It is Elton John! I didn't know who Elton John was until I watched The Simpsons. <laughs> no idea. I was like, who is that? I didn't that? know he really appeared that much in The Simpsons. He didn't. He didn't it was appear like a, a lot. Episode? But that was the first time I realized that I was completely out of touch with pop culture was I was watching that, and I was like, who's this guy? Why does he have a weird name? And my dad was like, he's like a super famous singer and I like talk to my friends and my teachers and they're like how could you not know who Elton John is this was back in the 90s right so he was a lot bigger then as well I had no idea this is when I realized I was completely out of touch uh, I'm also uh, out of touch because again you try to show me a bunch of his songs like, yeah I never heard this. <laughs> Will what incredibly rare vinyl soundtrack did Caleb buy for me for my birthday uh, the Hobbit one that is correct well done. I just remember that because Caleb was telling me about it for weeks. Well remembered. Well remembered. Kevin, this one's really hard. I do not expect either of you to get it. When I was converting the home videos for my family, what Transformers toy was I showing my grandfather and I have still not been able to find another copy of? What the... But fucking luck. <laughs> I told both of you this several times. I literally told you when I found the recolor of the toy and said that it was the wrong one. Good fucking luck. You're next. Make I don't need luck. No, but that okay. is a G1 Transformer, so you get bonus karma points, but no actual points. Will, right. do you have a guess? Waspinator. He is not a G1 Transformer. Um, okay, I will give you guys one clue. I know it's not going to help at all, but I'm going to do it anyways. The recolor of Bumblebee. 
He's that red. Bumblebee with a different color? <laughs> He's a red Volkswagen Beetle. Wouldn't that just be Bumblebee with a red color? No, that would not be Bumblebee with a red color. He is Cliff Jumper. The answer is Cliff Jumper. What the fuck kind of name is that? Cliff Jumper? Cliff Jumper. I didn't name him. That's his That's name. That's the single stupidest Transformer name I've ever heard. <laughs> Will, what indie horror game do I own all the versions of and all of the DLC? I don't fucking know. Oh, yes, uh, you do. Uh, what's that? That, that, uh... uh yeah, come on. Spooky talk. something or other castle. Give me the actual title. Either fucking, of them will it's, work. It's Spooky something castle. I don't know. Something, Ghost bitch castle. Something is incorrect. <laughs> Kevin, give me the answer. Oh, I'm, I'm right there with, well, it's like, yeah, it's spooky tales, something or another. I can't remember. <sighs> Please, yeah. just Spooky bat bitch's castle, I don't know. What is the game about? You go in a house, you go through rooms. What is I the speak? only mechanic in the game? <laughs> Spooky's walking castle? That's no. super creative. Come on, guys. Please. That's the only mechanic you walk around. House Wait, you do swing an axe. Okay, the two names I would have accepted are Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion and Spooky's House of Jump Scares. Oh, I'm going to take solace in the fact that you at least knew which game it was. <laughs> no points, though, because for fuck's sake, By the way, sake, jump guys, scare's not a mechanic. Yes, it is. It's literally... A mechanic is something you actively yeah, interact I'm, with. I'm not, I'm not going to argue with you about it. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> how many questions do we have left? I don't know. How many we questions? Have two You're questions. the one with the list. We have two questions left. I have one point. No, you have more than one point. You have, like, four. Kevin. Oh, boy. What is my preferred Silent Hill game? Two? Incorrect. Oh, Will. What is Origins. the correct sound? Absolutely not. Downpour is the correct answer. I'm glad that you remembered Origins, though. I didn't think you knew any of the games. Will, last question. I recently question. watched a video on, the, on Silent Hill Origins. Oh, for the love of Pete. <laughs> what is the name of the retro RPG game? That I love on PC and recently got a remake. Retro RPG. I have talked to you both about it at length, saying I wanted to do a Let's Play on it. Yep, I think I know which one. Mm -hmm. I passed to Kevin, because I don't know. Okay. Legend, Legend of Mana? Close. That is one that I have talked about. I'll give you a point, because that is also one that does match the criteria. The answer I was looking for was Outcast. Outcast? Outcast. It's a sci-fi RPG. But oh, I'm going to give Kevin the point. That game. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to give Kevin the point because Legend of Mana does fall under that. The only thing that it doesn't fall under is we did do a Let's Play of that game. Well. All right. That's it for round it. one. Wait, At round the one. end of round one, Will has one, two, three, four... Uh, four points, and Kevin has one, two, three, four. You are tied at four out of 21. You Kevin. got eight correct. Kevin, we did way better than I was expecting. <laughs> okay, round two. Kevin, who is my favorite Transformer? Uh, Didn't we do that one already? Yeah, we, we, we Are we you did. picking he's, up he's on test. the game? Yeah, he's, he's testing us. <laughs> oh, great. I don't remember. <laughs> I'm going to be real with you. That information immediately ejected. Soundwave. You are correct. Will. Mm. What high-grossing Hollywood actor was both the sound of the lions roaring in the Lion King and Fred Jones from Scooby-Doo? Fuck, I don't remember his name. Mark <laughs> Hamill? You literally oh! said to me, ask this question again. And on the inside, I was like, just you wait, fucker. <laughs> yeah, I, I honestly don't remember. Mark something, right? No, it is not. Kevin, do you remember? <laughs> no, I'm <laughs> The answer is Frank Welker. Okay. Yeah, I was not uh, going anywhere with the F. Kevin, what was my introduction to anime, in my opinion? Cotley Moore. Correct. Oh, thanks, Bob. Will. 
What no. is the main the name of the main character in Patley Bar? I will also accept know. the name of her robot. I, I don't remember either of them. <laughs> no, wait. Her name was like Noah. Uh, Noah something because it's like Noah's Ark. What was the second name? Can you I remember? I don't fucking know. It, All it, I remember was Noah and be like, oh, that's like Noah's Ark. If Kevin can't remember the second half, I will give you the point. Kevin, can you remember the surname? Uh, <laughs> Suzuki. <laughs> <laughs> There's no need to give me the point, Nate. I'm I'm okay with having less. Okay, Damaris. okay, okay. Well, we can go. Sure, I only remember the Noah part too. It is Noah Izumi. Izumi. He was Izumi. close to Suzuki. He was close. <laughs> <laughs> he was close. Kevin, what giant book did my sister buy me for my birthday that is difficult to read? We just went over this. <laughs> yeah. My brain went straight back to Lord of the Rings, even though we said that was wrong. I don't remember. This is exactly what I wanted. Oh, it was this. Oh, it was the Studio Ghibli movie. What? Which one was it? <laughs> one of their turdlies, I know. It's like I it was walking in the name. Walking was in the name. <laughs> and at least I remembered the Ghibli part. You did, yeah, yeah. Oh, Do you have a I'm guess? Walking, I remember walking something? No, it is not walking something. Will. I'm sad that I remember this. It's Wizards of Mercy. Correct. I'm not. Tr I'm first, trying not to learn more. First point Stop for teaching Will. Me more. First point for Will in round two. Kevin is in the lead. Will, what is my preferred Silent Hill game? My brain immediately went back to Origins. <laughs> it is not uh, Origins. I don't know Silent Hill Locker Room. No, it's not Silent Hill yeah, Locker Room. I know it's not a numbered one. I remember that much, but I don't fucking remember what it is. Kevin, do you remember? <laughs> Awakening? No. It's Downpour. Downpour. <laughs> Kevin. See, it did have a numbered. I remembered that. I did good. Kevin, what art project I completed made my father the Muppets. most disappointed? Correct, correct. The ones that you remember are really funny to me. Will, what is my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card? Uh, 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 nope. Don't know. I, look, I can't tell you what it is, so I'm going to go with, uh, <laughs> I don't know, that little sister-looking ones. No. <laughs> Incorrect. Kevin, I know you know. Arsha? Whatever the, the, the summon deal a thousand points of damage. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Don't I, know the, I know the stats of the fucking car before I know its actual name. Oh, I'm such a Yu-Gi-Oh player. I'm, gonna, I'm not giving you the point, but I really want to give you a bonus point for being the Yu-Gi-Oh player that you are. The name is Sateller Knight All Sam. Oh, it was a Sateller card. It was, it was. Fuck. I was, I, oh. I was pretty sure it was a Sateller card because that's your favorite archetype. Yes, you were very close, and I, I want to give you the point, but I'm not going to. You Kevin! Know, the worst part is, I've already forgot its name. All I know is Sateller now. <laughs> so I, I what game slated. series do I own ev on every possible platform? Ace Attorney. Correct! Oh, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Will, what year did the Cartoon Transformers movie get released? I don't know. 1970s? Incorrect. Kevin. 1986. Correct! All we're learning is that Kevin has a little bit more retention than Will. <laughs> Man, it's almost like one of us goes out of our way not to learn things. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, in the home movies I was converting for my family, what Transformer was I showing my grandfather? Cliff Jumper. That Correct! I'm, I'm so proud of remembered. Kevin right now. I'm so proud of Kevin right now. <laughs> I, I was like, Bumblebee? <laughs> no, I was oh, like, yeah. you know, it was a stupid name. I remember it being fucking <laughs> yep. dumb. <laughs> Will, what indie horror game do I own all the versions of and all the DLC? Undertale? Are you actually <laughs> fucking kidding me, Will? I don't remember. Are you actually... Are you throwing for content? <laughs> no, I don't remember. Kevin... What's... Spooky House of Jump Scares? Correct. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that old <laughs> stick. Holy fuck, Will. We went on and on with like five or ten minutes. <laughs> Kevin, what it is... It's 28 and a half degrees and going up in my apartment. I am so fucking <laughs> cooked, I can't think. 
Kevin, what is the rarest piece of gaming tech I own? Game Boy Light. Correct. <laughs> Will, I don't think you can win. I, I can't. No, right. I'm okay with this. We're getting pretty close here. Until uh, round three. <laughs> uh, actually, we are, in fact, into round three. Oh, no. Will, okay. what high-grossing Hollywood actor was both the sound of the oh, lion's roaring remember and his Fred Jones' Scooby-Doo? Stop asking me! I don't know! <laughs> you know what? He's Joey Woodrow. That's his name. <laughs> Kevin, do you remember? Uh, Frank. You are half correct. Can you get uh, the second half? Uh, sorry, it's with a w. It does start with a W. Welker? Yes! Kevin gets that point. As he should. As he should. Because Will is so far behind, I'm going to let him go first. What is my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card, Will? Oh, I don't... It was something like... What is it? Grocery teller or something? <laughs> it's teller something. I don't know. <laughs> Kevin, you want to help him? It was a teller card. Okay, that's great. So it's Sateller Grocery Store Clerk. I don't fucking remember. <laughs> Kevin, do you remember his name this time? Yeah, that's... <laughs> oh, no. Uh, uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> Give me... Sateller uh... <laughs> Ghibli shit. That's what we're going with. <laughs> All Sam. All yes! Sam. Yes! It is all Sam. I love all Sam. Oh. Okay, I was like, it's not it's not Deneb. What the fuck was his name? <laughs> I am having way too much fun. Uh, Will, what is my preferred Silent Hill game? Fuck, I don't know. Drainage? You are so close. You're on the right track. It I don't know, a pool? It's something to do with water. It is, but it's not. Will, uh, Kevin, what is it? Downpour. Correct. Will, that was very close. You I know got it was the context. water something. I'm just, I'm just going to give Will all of them first, Kevin. Uh, just because. Go for it. What is the name of the main character in Patleybor? It's Noah something. <laughs> I know it's not Suzuki, but my brain is now, <laughs> it's now Noah Suzuki. <laughs> You That's know it's not brain... Suzuki, try. Just try. I know it's not. It's uh, it's an Asian name. I can't fucking pull that out of my ass. <laughs> the fact that by the time I got to round three, you still weren't listening is amazing. Hey, right, we're going to get to round six. I'm still not going to be listening. Kevin, do you remember the name? Noah Izumi. Correct. <laughs> and I believe that that was all of them answered correctly. Oh, that was that was a uh, that was fun, guys. I'm gonna count up the points now. Do you do you want to know? Uh, I won, so no. <laughs> uh, you won. I you did not win. Um, unless math has changed. Kevin no, has I, I won. One, I have the two, least number. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Kevin has sixteen, and if my math is correct, that means Will has five. Yeah. Five. Points. Will's so, not the stalker here. He didn't know everything. There we how go. How enjoyable was that for you guys? I had a great time. Uh, not gonna lie, moderately embarrassing that it took three rounds. For, like realistically, it should have only taken two. See, but, uh, no. Uh, to be fair, though, to be fair, I have seen this game played multiple times. Almost always, it takes three rounds to get all of them. It's because you don't expect that the next round to be the same questions again. It's kind of a mind trick. It's only... If I was the one doing this, I would have been Will. A hundred percent. We all know I don't listen. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here's the thing. It, if we were to do this with all of us, it would, it would be like a 19-game streak. Yeah, no, and I, when I listened to this, it actually did go to round six. You guys finished it in round three. I... It is a little bit more... The the, uh, the one that I listened to, they did general trivia questions that you learned in, like, elementary and high school, which uh, <coughs> I think is way harder, honestly. Uh, yeah, that would not go well. One of the questions was, what is the uh, what is the name of light reflecting through a pane of glass? Do you guys know? Because I didn't. I don't fucking know, no. It's, it's apparently diffraction. 
That makes sense. They also asked what the rarest, like, mineral in the world is, which is apparently acetine. D don't even know what that is. Gonna be honest. Mm -hmm. uh, I was not as crushed as I thought I would be. It was actually... So you guys got some of the ones I did not think you would get in the first one. My favorite one is still Will saying, I don't know, maybe Toy Story. <laughs> Honestly, it was the oldest Disney film I could think of that was somewhere in the 90s. I'm like, yeah, fuck it, that could work. I would like to think that it just fell into your mind because I have literally talked about it so much. No, it, it was barely... What's the oldest one I know that's not from, like, 1912? Yeah. Yeah, I, it was really funny to me because at the beginning of the game, and I'm just like, it's all about how well you guys listen to me, and then you get to round two, and it's, like, apparently not very well. Although, Kevin... You did not get... The only one you got wrong more than once was Noah Izumi and Frank Welker. That's it. And to be fair, those are the only ones where it's someone's proper name. Not counting Satellar Knight All Sam. We're not going to count that. <laughs> I was very uh, impressed. You guys did really well for something that I'm pretty sure I 100% blindsided you with. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I wasn't yeah. prepared for this shit. Uh, that's kind of the point. And I have to say, Will, my favorite thing in this whole episode is when you said, ask me that again at the end to see <laughs> that I will still not know and you did not lie to me. You know what the best part is? Yeah. I don't remember what his name is anymore. I know it's you don't. It's already gone. I know you don't. In the podcast I first listened to this, they have brought up one of the questions in like five episodes and they still cannot get it right. That's great. I'm not going to remember. Here's the, th the best part is... When this goes up, I'm going to be, oh, right, I remember I didn't remember that guy's name. Until then, after this is done, I will not even think about that question. That's fair. That's fair. To be honest, most of these things are not things that it matters that you know about me. They don't matter. They are useless facts. I just thought this would be a fun thing to do because it is a very interesting study in short-term memory loss. <laughs> so, so I'm going to throw this out there. What do you mean by most? What do you mean most? Oh, not as in most. most of these All. are not important. I mean, yeah, no, no, not, not most. I know some All. If you want, I'm willing to have you guys put together 20 questions to see if I can answer any of them for another episode. I don't episode. Even have 20 questions about my you, life. You can do it together. You can do 10 each and see if I can guess any of them. Kevin, do we even have 10 questions each about our lives? I mean, to be fair... Like, we could give him some super easy ones like Nate did, and then give him some super hard ones. So realistically, yeah. you only need, like, maybe two or three. Yeah, because some of those were pretty easy. Like, for instance, Treasure Planet, I'm pretty sure you both knew that. Yeah. Sure. We yeah. I, that. I did not know the Toy Story one. I was, when you asked that, I was like, Bug's Life? We're going to go with Bug's Life. <laughs> that would have been very <laughs> incorrect. No, and I, I, I didn't think you guys would know the year, but I thought there was a chance, because I have talked about how I was five years old. When I saw Toy Story in theaters, a lot. Here's a great one, Nate. When was I, when was I born? 1993. Hey, you actually knew that, because your brother. I I can neither confirm nor deny that. Ask Man. me what month, and I will not say because we're on a recording. But I also don't know. That's fair. Uh, actually, wait. I think I do. I, okay, I know 50-50. It's either yours or your brother's. Is this correct? That is correct. Okay, good. I do know. I do I'm not surprised. know Kevin's. I do not know, and that's because he hates parties. I also do not know Kevin's. That's fine. Uh, yeah, so if you guys want to do this and you want to torture me and show how terrible my listening is, we can do this. I am, And to make it even more fair, on one of the days, lie to me. And tell me that we're going to play a different game and then start the trivia so I do not have a chance to think about it ahead of time. Cool. Oh, oh, yes, I think. And I, I think we need Will's reaction for this. <laughs> you want to do something now? Because I'm down. That was a pretty short recording. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, give, me, give me one second. I could throw some shit off the top of my head. Yeah, we can. I think it's only fair... That because I got to do this to you guys, you get to do something to me. <laughs> I can agree to Kevin's plan, so we're not going to do it today. But. We're not going to do it today. Okay, that's fine. I, I will accept whatever punishment 
I receive for testing my friend's friendship. We are all good friends, which has been proven today, just not the best at listening. At least one of the three of us is evidently worse than the other two. So until next time, guys, say goodbye. Bye. Bye. Ah!